Today we are on the hunt for Magic the Gathering cards in an antique mall located in Medina, Ohio. And there is plenty of antique goodies around me. Let's see, you'll be fine. I know I, I came across a lot of sports cards already, but I just got started here, so let's have a look. <laughs> Bingo. Back in my day, look what I found. The love machine. Ooh. Oh yeah. Let's see what happens. Alright, let's see what she got. Ooh. Sabrina's giving it a go. It looks good. You can see clearly. Burning innocent passion icebox. I had no pep. Oh, wow, that was a great thing. Um, how does fire <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, that game is broke. Simba. Okay, remember, Sabrina did have surgery. Um, we're still waiting on some results to see if it's spread or what, whatnot. For anyone who doesn't want to see this, turn away right now. Turn away right now. Okay, go ahead. Oh... Yeah, almost like the size of a quarter and like three millimeters deep. Like, um, so far, so good though. There you have it. Which key will open the room of Alpha Magic Cards? Hmm. <laughs> we are laughing. Who can tell me what this is? Where's PETA? Bastards. I used to get down back in the day. Plenty more aisles to stroll. Here's Mr. Monkey. Hey, Jax, smile the camera. Hey! Oh, look, it's a Goonie. Cool. A much simpler time. Is that an antique <laughs> Beckham Jr. jersey? It is. Some vintage Browns goodies right there. Vintage U.S. Navy. Respect to all those serving in the military or who have served in the military. Appreciate your service. Hustler. What they selling here, man? The Hustler. Hustler. Action toy builder. Cool. That's different. Oh, I had one of these when I was a little girl. He looks thrilled to be here. I like these old Pepsi uh, displays, pretty cool. Do, 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 do. Oh, hello, Mr. Parrot. China. Hey, Jackson, come over here for a minute. I want you to take a look at this. Just let him run free in this aisle. He'll be all right. Ooh, look at the cars. Got old cars here, Jax. You're probably too short to see him, though. What a shame. Time to grow a little, Billy. Time to grow a little. Oh my god, Jackson, we got your new toy. Oh, my sister had one of these. My favorite. Barbie. Is that Barbie? No. It's Family Corners. It's so weird looking at this stuff like and thinking this isn't an antique mall now. I remember playing with little micro machines when I was a kid. Thank you. Mom, mom. Oh my goodness. I mom. love baby spice. Mom. Spice girl. Spice. Now that's something to collect. That's what I'm saying. 170, 170 bucks. bucks. Wow. Oh, that's probably like the original. Oh, Concert good. collection. So those are like selling when they were on mom. tour. Wow, that's cool. Mom. Oh, right on, man. There you go. Some vintage uh, action figures. Pretty cool. Oh, we got some sports cards. Oh, that is really cool. I, I had something just like that, Jax. That is cool. Nintendo vintage. It's craziness. Oh, it's so. Oh, my God, there's Zelda right there. Babe, I, I had want that. Card. What, the Zelda? Oh, yeah. The Nintendo vintage. Don't you already have that? 
Nintendo Man, I had like a hundred Atari games. I had like maybe fifty Nintendo games, maybe sixty Nintendo they games. Madden and Zelda. They got the classics down there. Oh my goodness. Some sports cards. Reason. I just read there. Both shelves for a thousand bucks. Everybody just pointed it out. Wow. That's nutty. Ooh. Old comic books. Who still has their old comic book collection? Anything good? Pretty cool. Thor. Some of these are worth a lot of money. 110 bucks, whatever that one is. Pretty legit. Ooh, Starmate. This is really cool. I had a very small comic book collection. Nothing, nothing nuts. Good old Mad TV. Hey, Roy Rogers, how you doing there, fella? I did not get into Power Rangers. I had to tell my little brother, Sean, to step back to my Power Ranger all the time. Because I was so naughty. <laughs> Never got into Power Rangers. But I was a fan of these two. You know what I'm going to do to you, Hogan? That's not how Ultimate Warrior sounds, though. But, you know, you could imagine if he did. <laughs> All right. Enough of the older sports cards. I need to see me some vintage magic cards. And for dirt cheap. Like grab bags of them. Big old grab bags. Whoa, we got some naughties down there. Hello there. 700 big ones. Get yourself the Barbie Forest Elf. That's almost considered magic. Oh, it's the Hardy Boys. Now there is some serious digging through. If you're into some uh, some comic books, this guy got pallets worth of the good old magazines. Pretty legit. Extremely disappointed with the new Mary Poppins film. Just saying. I always thought Mary Poppins, the original one. Oh man, she was a smoking babe. Winner, winner. That'd be fun to have in the house. I was, I just was gonna say for I was parties. Sure. I always wanted one. Just to be an awesome fun. I was My uh, uncle Larry had one. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not magic, but it is Pokemon. So we're getting closer, but this one's all like cased up and stuff. They're like, yeah, we know we got something worth some dough here, fella. So there's some Pokemon. No magic, though. Magic's got to be cool enough to be in this place. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, we told you to get those. Vintage. Silky shears. Oh, let's try it out. Now we're talking action figures. Wow. I had the OG freaking turtles. I don't think they have any in here, but the original turtles from, I don't know when it was, the 80s, whenever they dropped. Really cool. Nice selection here. Beanie Babies, which never amounted to crap, but holy crap, are those sought after. What are you seeing? Got some big old boats. You want a big old boat? Oh, babe, catch. What is that? Baseball, football, football. If I see anything magic, I'll just pick it up. I see the Pokemon thing, which grabbed my attention. I think they did that on purpose. You see any magic in there, guys? You see any magic? I see... Or no, not the Pokemon, the Yu-Gi-Oh. That looks like all Yu-Gi-Oh. The Hulkster. Oh, Well, they hating on magic up in here? What's going on, fellas? It's not looking like any magic. I love playing like that. There he is. Ah, oh, we used to do these back in school. What did you call this stuff? I can't remember. Ah, oh, I can't think of the name of it. Want to touch me, honey? What a babe. Daddy. They're scary. The scary Daddy. look of these old bunny picnics. $8 to set. What a steal. The tree. Imagine if that was someone's pecker. Oh! Some old school gun cannons, basically. Holy crap. Pretty freaking legit. Musketeers. Ain't no muskets in there, Joey. You got some swords over here and whatnot. Maybe some katanas. I don't even know the names of these things. Not cheap though. Holy smothering tithe. That one in the back's 950. Holy crap. 
Pretty cool. Oh, perfect. Oh, that, that looks razzle-dazzle. That's, that's why you're burning right there. We had this exact game of life right here when I was growing up with that exact picture on there. Craziness. Let's be real, y'all copied Monopoly. Some more cards. Old school stuff. Hey, good old Jim Grant in the back. All right. Luke Easter, classics, classics. Tim Brown, or I'm, I said Tim Brown, Jim Brown. Jim Brown, uh, that's not even that old. That was more recent Panini Contenders, but uh, a rare, a more rare card. Uh, pretty legit. Oh, they got some studs over here, huh? Some more sports cards, some ladies. Ladies in bikini wear, there you go. A little, some modeling. Mm -hmm. Of course, you gotta have coins at the coin, or at the uh, antique mall. You gotta have your collection of coins. Anyone collect coins? I know I got a patron, or uh, I have a couple patrons that collect coins. Pretty cool. Hey, look, it's George Washington. How cool is that? Oh my god, it is. Jackson, that was our first the Good United old States. George. When the Cleveland Browns were good enough to grace the cover of a game. Cardiac kids. Looking like some Civil War type stuff going on. Oh, yeah. Some Gettysburg. Whoa, look at that, man. What was those, uh, oh, wow. Some, is that some old bullets and some... Yeah. I don't know what you call them all, but wow. That's some old school stuff right there, man. Very freaking cool. Are those... That is ammunition, right? Sharp? They call them sharps? What am I looking at here? What's that for? For ramming the, in the musket or something? I don't even know. Golf game. <sighs> Goat. Some more Gettysburg stuff. I mean, you get some original photos from Gettysburg times. Oh, man. It's pretty crazy. Sweet. China. I can't believe they put the Backstreet Boys on one of these. Yeah, it's weird. Arr, I can't believe I haven't seen one magic card yet. This is bonkers. Got some nice little cards up in this one, though. Look at that. That is, is that a Steve Young rookie card back, back there? I like that. Why the hell would anyone want to buy depression glass? Sounds depressing. <laughs> I like little miniatures. Give you 10 bucks for that bill and a dollar for that one. Oh, sweet. Rolling Stones, man. Nice. I remember not going to that concert. The Alka Seltzer, the OG Alka Seltzer. Get the whole display for one ninety five. Oh, that's pretty cool. Native American back in the day. I actually uh, remember bidding on some of this stuff before. Whoops, I was a little off camera there. There you go. Pretty cool. I can't go too much further up here because there is nudity. I think we should get those. Pictured. It's a full <laughs> deck. Full deck of nude women playing cards? Nude pinup playing cards. From back in the day. <laughs> That's cool. Everywhere I go, man, there's so many sports cards, but there is no magic. Lots and lots of jewelry. Ooh, some basketballs. Signed by somebody. There's no cookies. Yes, how much for the Kimberland Dairy chocolate flavored milk? And those suckers are huge. Holy crap, look at that. Whoa there. Not gonna lie, getting a little I'm a little disappointed right now that I'm not seeing a single magic card anywhere. What's going on? These are, these are all the things that I opened. How much are they? Six bucks. 
None. She had these sitting, like, wrapped up in her Christmas. They were given to me. In her Christmas, like your Christmas boxes, you know, stowed away. So when Christmas comes, she just looks at them in the sealed box. So I took them out the box, threw them on the tree. Okay. All right. Weirdest thing you ever collected. What is the weirdest thing you ever collected or own? Let me hear the weirdest thing you own or have ever collected. I'm going to think about mine before the video is over. Peter Pan. Oh, it's Sambo. That's legit. That is one sweet looking roller coaster if I've ever seen one. What? I have that at home. You have that right there? <laughs> yeah. My, my mom's old couple of stuff. Stop it. Some planes. Pretty legit. Oh, U.S. Air Force. Look at those little minis. You, you at least could have spelled something. I really enjoy looking at old vintage toys. Pretty cool. Looking like old war memorabilia. That concludes our journey here. No luck with any magic, unfortunately, but you don't have that on these big jobs. As luck would have it, I couldn't find anything magic related at the flea market, which was a big bummer. So I had to pick up something. And these were the last two collector boosters on the shelf at a Walmart. And I couldn't help myself. So I'm like, all right, let's get something. Got to have something magic in this video. And when they're the last two, you know what? How do you open these? Man, holy packaging. Have you guys ever seen some of friggin' packaging in your day? Oh my goodness. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Wizards cutting down on packaging. Yeah, dude. <sighs> all right. Aiden, you want to crack this one open? Sure. All right, just, just uh, don't open it, but just open that part. Yeah. All right, I'm going to get this going. Someone told me that they pulled a freaking uh, a neon ink card out of one of these random packs at Walmart, and I, I'm like, wow. If, if that's the case, damn it, I need to buy more. Okay, here we go. So I couldn't help myself. Let's find it. Let's find some neon ink, because I would love to have one. There we go. Boom. We only opened one of each kind, which is kind of normal for everyone. All right, Aki, get your hands off the table. Boy, you're shaking my stuff. Come on now. All right, Moon Snare Specialist. Come on, baby. Something juicy. Oh, the Kami War. I have purchased uh, probably like 50 copies of Kami War, just so you guys know. Yeah, I know. It's stupid. Okay. Uh, Research Thief. Come on, baby. Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. Cloud Steel Gurren. Grease Fang Okiba. I don't think we got anything crazy. Oh, the Silent Spider. I have no luck with these Walmart packs, I swear. All right, last one here. Just a little something, just to have some magic uh, content in the video. Because, uh, just uh, not thrilled, you know. Couldn't find nothing at the flea market, but I'd like to hear your guys' stories if you ever opened anything freaking really good. Uh, or found anything good at a flea market. Let me know. Let me hear about it. Here we go. Here we go. Mm, last pack to crack. It's Mothman back. Sky Blast, Imperial, Ink Rise. Come on, Daddy. Oh, come on, come on, come on with the Ink Rise. Explosive Singularity. Cool, Mythic, but not what we are looking for. One more, baby. Come on, one more. Come on. Access Denied. Oh, damn it. We know what that means. We're not going to get one. Farewell. That's cool. Come on. Big hit. I always get screwed on these. Come on. Oh. Damn it. Oh. Well, that has gotten to be the, like, sixth time I've gotten hosed on Walmart Magic the Gathering. Shop your LGS, guys. There wasn't one around, so I just stopped at one at a Walmart. Appreciate you tuning in. Join most Bad Boy Gaming. Skadoosh. Baking up for teenage crime.